Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for EU4 as we continue our run here with Champa. Let's go ahead and unpause here. We're uh, continuing to upgrade our ships, although we also still have to owe China some money every year. Or Ming, I should say, sorry. They are quite large. <laughs> they are quite large and in charge. Uh, protect our trade. Yeah, we'll protect our trade. They still just overpower us, don't they? I sure would have loved to have consumed Khmer by now, but I guess it was never meant to be. money. Let's detach the last of our obsolete ships. And that would be you guys come back and get upgraded. Also, I think we can buy a few more ships. Three more. Age of Revolutions. At least 50 development in the capital. We can work towards that. Or form your own empire. I mean, it would take us a while to get to 50 development, but we definitely could get there. I didn't know that they'll wait till they repair before they move out. That's really awesome. I think that actually gets us enough to go ahead and... Almost, not quite. We'll continue to be nice to the Emperor for now. How many people does he have still under him? Not very many. Champa. I mean, we're one of the few that lives on this list, but you know, it is what it is. The only way we could um, break free, I think, at this point, is if we would also turn around and then, like, we're able to ally them. But as soon as we broke this, they, they probably would hate us, so I don't know. It's a pretty big boost in manpower. Check this every once in a while, make sure there's nothing that jumps out at me that says, okay, yeah, that would be really worthwhile. I mean, I could see the value putting up, but I don't know, I don't know that we need it right now. Of all the things we could upgrade here, that probably is the best. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. That'll be the last building we can put up, and then we'll be fine.
And I don't think we need any of that stuff. Oh, we never built our temple city thing, um, which we will do. I thought we would. Why is it not showing up? I mean, I see it here, but I thought I'd see it here. Oh, it's at the very top. Duh. Okay. I'm blind. Oh, we're about to take a loan. I forgot about Ming for a moment there. That's all right. Oh, no. They wanted. Never mind. Oh, we lost an advisor. Oh, there's our next one right there. Ducats. I don't need the national unrest reduction right now, so let's take the legitimacy. Alliance from Brittany. Are you of any value, Mr. Brittany? Probably not really. I mean, very high tech level. Otherwise, not. But they are allied with Great Britain and Portugal, which are two people that I probably would be the most afraid of. And a royal, mar royal marriage with us. You know what? Why not? We'll be nice to our European nation. Gotta love some free trade efficiency. Did you ever build a rank three thing up here? I don't remember. Yeah, okay, we set the top level. Uh, so the next one would be like one of these over here or something. It's at 19. The other option is to go ahead and go around and do all the ones that... Oh, this is actually really good. All that base tax is worth it, even if we take out a loan. A uh, little bit... Yeah, that's fine. Uh, okay, so mil military is... Yeah, we definitely would like to hold off until we can embrace enlightenment. Not quite there yet, but we'll get there soon. Last of the quantity ideas. Colonial garrisons. What does that even give us? Global seller increased land force limit. This is what costs us though, right? Yeah. I don't think we need this one right this second. Maybe someday. We definitely will take some of these. In fact, we'd probably take all three of those. I already see some land. Do that though. Three allies. Eh. All right, fine. Do the three ally one. Let's go ahead and see some land. Everybody's good. Um, and then maybe grab the Diplo Power one.
Yeah. Let's grab the Diplo Power person. And then eventually we'll grab the military one as well. And that I think that'll be it. Oh, you know what? We probably don't need all of these anymore. I mean, the plus 5% morale when at war with heretics or heathens, probably okay. This one... I mean, I'd like to revoke it, but we would have some uprisings. We might want to revoke this at some point, though. I don't think we need this one, actually. Although maybe it's not hurting, just existing there. Got all our ships, right? Everything's a heavy frigate. Yep. Okay, our army force limit is significantly higher than I thought it was going to be. Okay, well, we know what we're doing next. I guess we're building out another one of these troops. 36, so it'd be 72 plus 36 would be 108. Yeah, that's perfect. So we need another one with, uh, was it 16 infantry? Well, I say it's perfect. It's actually not perfect because this is already a full front and back, right? This would not be. So just back, this would kind of just be a spare army at the end of the day. So we'll just go ahead and bump it up though. Start with the infantry, and we'll go from there. I'm going to put a quick pause in the video. I'll be right back. All right, we are back. Sorry about that. I just realized that my dinner was sitting next to me getting cold. I was like, you know what? I better eat that real quick. <laughs> All right, let's unpause here. Get our troops built up. Uh, what do I want to do next? I kind of want to go through... Well, first off, let's go through all of the, um... Excuse me. Um... Trade value ones. Make sure all of these guys are boosted up. As much as they can be. With any of these buttons to push that we already can push. And then if there's... Then we're going to go back through the list and see if there's any that we can't push right now that are very close to being pushable, if that's the right way to say that. I'm not even gonna look at those right now. Okay, let's just focus on these. For example, this one's green, right? Has it already been expanded? This one's already been expanded. Okay, cool. Let's check the green ones real quick. That one's already been expanded. There was a green one down here. Not been expanded because it doesn't have enough development. That needs what, 15? 15. We probably want to get some development here. Oh, I forgot we had an extra colonist. We could just send a colonist here and get it naturally, or I could just develop it up myself. Feels like a really good idea in general. We need seven more. Okay, that gets us there. Let's hit the button. Um, might make some things worthwhile as far as like other buildings now. I think we'll just do that one for now. Let's see, is there any new buildings that we can now build there? That are, yes. Suddenly, very, very worthwhile. Might actually build that one too. That one's pretty borderline. And again, presumably we'll just get better over time. Down to 46 ducats a month right now.
What did I just hit? Oh. I didn't realize China was there. Underneath the thingy, asking for money. I know that wasn't what that was. I don't know what just caused. I might have just hit something else accidentally. Oh, I think I put another Temple City somewhere. Oh, I might have just clicked through and hit one of these back in the background. It's not what I wanted to do, but it's not the end of the world. Let me just hit one more month so I can hit this button, then we'll worry about other things. Or that now. Um, let's go see. We're high on Diplo. I made more trade efficiency. Makes sense. The merchant soon. Definitely want to finish this up relatively soon. Alright, probably going to have to take another loan to pay China, but that's fine. Hey, another point. That's awesome. Five points away. Make us take a loan, we'll let ding up and be fine. Because we'll have it next month. Okay, I think we're fine. Okay. We'll pay off this loan here in a minute. Then we'll probably finish working on our troops. Oh, we need another ally, didn't we? For our thing. So let's see if we can find us another ally. I guess at this point it doesn't matter as much who it is. As much as it does just to have it. Uh, I think we'll take the stability. are all so small. I don't know. It doesn't matter who it is. Just get somebody. Hopefully that gets us the three, right? Because we've... Uh, yeah, we should have three now. Yep, there we go. Get that done. Any more buildings worth anything? No, not really. Five is not really. <laughs> More land force limits, which actually might not be a bad idea. What's the naval force limit? Grab this one. And if there's still a land one, I'll grab it as well. Okay. I'm happy with those choices. Wow, we, that, that guy is really doing his job. That is awesome. Oh, I never sent the other colonists. Um, do we want to... I might just come over here. Start getting you boosted. Getting you to 25 would be... Well, not you, sorry. Manila is what I wanted. So I can get the next one in there as well. Our 
pay off this loan here in a minute. Nine is borderline worth it. Probably is worth it, but I'm going to be stubborn and wait. All right, let's go ahead and get you your two calf. And I guess we'll start working on the artillery as well. Hey, alignment's appeared. Do we want to start flipping some states over? I mean, the trade power is extremely important, but getting the spread is also extremely important. I think we will temporarily flip that over, and then you also. Get everything flipped. Let's get everything spread as quickly as possible here. I'll be reduced this quite a bit, though. 55 down to what? Okay, that's not bad. We can we can afford that cost. All right, military's high. Again, we're trying to work on this embracement, so we're not going to worry about anything else technology-wise right now. Unless these guys are rather at 25. Okay, they're right at 25. Never mind. We're going to have to take the hit. I, I still want to be one behind is my goal. Actually, increase the combat width. <laughs> okay, well, that's going to mess up some of my math, but that's okay. All right, so we're one behind now. And then we do need to work on the math here, uh, which basically means two more infantry and two more artillery for each of these. Although we can just pull that from this group right here. No. Well... Capital area provinces. It's a lot of money, but it does get that spread very quickly. You know, what else are we spending our money on? I think it's worth it. All right, so let's grab two infantry and two artillery. You guys come down to there. Wait, did I get my math wrong? 38, so we want... It'll put us at 40. We don't want 40. We want... Uh, It's one in one, right? No? Yeah, it's one in one. Yes, because once we combine it with this one, it's one in one. Okay. So this group actually go to here, and then we'll just split you in half, and half will go each. Okay, that, that doesn't math better. I was like, something wasn't mathing up. Because the, the number of troops here should be the full 38, so that when I combine them, they're at the full front line and the back front back line. Oh, if we complete maritime ideas, anybody's or trade ideas. 
Must be the strongest trade power somewhere in specific. Which I don't know how many of those we are. Probably not any of those. <laughs> Alright. Looking for Malaya. We need a lot more to do that. Uh, what else are we doing? We do still have more troops that we would like to grab. Now it is 17, 2, and 19. So, three more of you. Let's see how many of those we can afford. So we do one more, which will put us one short of the number, but that's okay. Oh, that's annoying. Okay. Caps out all of our troops. Um, okay, and we just need to keep an eye on the institution spread here. Well, not here specifically, but in these other places. get it oh I definitely want don't, don't want tax bonifier reduction I guess we'll take the autonomy change that's not ideal either but should not impact us right now more ships well I was gonna look to see what do we need to have to on explorations Um, do we even have explorers? It's not one of those. I don't remember where you get explorers from, to be honest. Uh, is it from here? Yeah, it's down here, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So we don't have the quest for the New World. National idea. No worries. Alright. Captain Admin. Actually would mean we need new admin. Idea group. I mean, going some like innovative would be kind of interesting, but it's kind of late for that. I need the missionaries. National tax modifier would be really good. Yeah, this one, this one just makes the most sense. Advisor cost being reduced is also pretty significant. Don't care about the national unrest. State maintenance is interesting. No, I think we take economic ideas. We're going to be a money powerhouse. And immediately just take a tax modifier boost, which is immediately going to... It's a pretty significant boost in our overall money. Actually making more money from trade all of a sudden. I did not realize. I mean we're down to 21 ducats a month, but that's just because we're sharing knowledge. Hey, we've played with these guys before, haven't we? I feel like I have. I might have been on my own time, I don't remember now. Army maintenance is pretty significant. Could drop that down, but I don't know if that's a value in that or not right now. Oh, we're about to cap on Diplo. Sorry. 
So again, same idea. Until we embrace the next thing, we're just going to use this. Grab you. More, another merchant. I'm sorry, no, this is not another merchant. This is just merchant trade power. Well, that's nothing wrong with that. Almost able to grab these last two. Not quite. As soon as we can, we probably will want to. Twenty-two ducats with trading weight eighteen of it. We're not over on military, right? Like we're not. No, we're actually under on ships. Although we have two more ships coming out. All right, we're we'll going to put a cut in there. When we come back, keep working on our technology, keep working on our ideas. Go from there. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.